Okay, this is how to use your QWERTY keyboard as a MIDI controller for within um, Easy Drummer in the Reaper door specifically. I'm sure it can be done with other doors and I'm sure some of the concepts will apply, but this is going to be within Reaper specifically. So I couldn't find any concrete answer online, despite many people asking within various forums how to do it or whether or not it was even possible, and I couldn't see anyone whatsoever who knew exactly how to do it. So after figuring it out myself, it seemed like the right thing to do to just share it with you. So I'm going to go ahead and open up Reaper. I already have a template built um, with an instance of Easy Drummer in there. If not, just insert new track, virtual instrument, and then select Easy Drummer from there. Um, and like I said earlier, for me specifically, someone who's not a drummer, it's very, very handy to be able to do this, and it means I don't have to spend money on um, extra hardware, in this instance, a MIDI controller. So, there's just two really important concepts. Setting up is really easy, it's quite intuitive, but if you don't do these two things, it can catch you out, and then it'll just look like it's not working. So if you take care of these two things, it should work. Number one is making sure the Easy Drummer instance, as in the top level instance of it, is record armed. If the recording isn't armed, like so, it won't work. It won't register the QWERTY keyboard um, as a MIDI input. It actually won't even think you're playing anything whatsoever. So go ahead, make sure that's armed. And then you're going to have to also have Reaper's virtual MIDI keyboard open. So you can find that under View and Virtual MIDI Keyboard, or the keyboard shortcut, which is easier, Alt-B. Now, if this isn't on top, it won't work. It'll just be the same as having the recording unarmed. What do I mean by that? You've got to make sure that the window's on top. As you can see here, the text is greyed out because I've got Easy Drummer clicked. I'm working uh, Reaper clicked. I'm working within here. Anytime you want to make any kind of recording, make sure this window's on top. You can drag it around, and then you can see all the letters, and you can go from there. Open up Easy Drummer. And then you'll see straight away, because the keyboard is on top and the recording is armed, it's going to work. Like that. Now all the keys are labelled Z, S, X, D, blah blah blah, so you can figure out which key does what. Some of them won't do anything, you might have to arm them, or it might depend on which kit you're using. But, if you go into search, tap to find, you can then create drum beats from here. And then find similar ones. So here's a couple of matches. You can go through, choose whichever one you like. If you find one, you can then just go ahead and drag it onto the track, and it'll recognize it from there. 